Hi, my name is Francois Jean from Fastair, and in this Woodcraft tutorial, I will explore taking measurements with the app. I'll create a new project to demonstrate this. First, let's create a 2x4 and verify its dimensions. To create measurements, I tap on the Tools menu and select the Measurements item. This puts the application in a special mode as indicated by the gray overlay in the upper right corner. This overlay serves as a guide the first few times you use Woodcraft and tells you how to proceed. First, I have to select an object which I want to measure. We'll pick our 2x4. Then, I have to select what to measure. You'll notice little X's on the screen which represent the endpoints or vertices of our object. I need to select two vertices to create a measure. Now, I can adjust the position of the measure by dragging the slider. When I'm satisfied, I can tap the plus button to confirm. You'll notice that my measurements are not shown. This is because the measurements tool is still active as indicated by the overlay in the upper right corner. I'll go ahead and create a second measure for my 2x4. When I'm satisfied, I can exit the tool by pressing its icon in the overlay, like so. Back in the main view, I can finally see my measurements and they appear correctly as one and a half inches by three and a half inches. Let's see if this will work for adding rough lumber. On the Add Object panel, you'll see a switch that can toggle between rough or finished lumber. By default, it's set to off, which produces nominal lumber. Let's go ahead and switch it to on. I'll use the same 2x4 lumber template I was using and make similar measurements. The application correctly measured this rough piece of lumber as a true 2x4. Measurements are tied to the view they were created in. If I move to another view, my measurements disappear. However, if I return to the original view, my measurements are back. This is to avoid clutter on the screen. I'll go back to the measurements tool to show you a couple of last things. You can remove measurements by tapping the trash can icon on a given measure. You can also adjust a measure's position if you don't feel it is correct. Finally, you can select two different objects to be the source of a given measure and create a measurement between these two objects. The measurements will be updated as you move or rotate one piece or the other. Thanks for watching. We hope you have fun working with Woodcraft.